They called it the Black Widow, a night fighter built to hunt what no other aircraft could find. But in the final years of the war, engineers asked a new question. What happens when you strap rockets to a Black Widow? This is the story of the P-61 and the Jado tests that pushed it far beyond its limits. The Black Widow was already a monster in the sky, twin engines, long wings, radar in the nose, and a crew trained to fight in darkness. It wasn't fast like a Mustang, and it wasn't agile like a lightning. But at night, it owned the sky. Still, pilots on short jungle strips and remote island bases had one problem. The P-61 was heavy. Too heavy? And in tropical heat, even to powerful engines didn't always give it the takeoff punch it needed. And her JATO jet assisted takeoff. Small rockets, mounted under the fuselage, fired for a few seconds, but delivering a punch strong enough to launch a heavy aircraft into the air like a slingshot. During the tests, crews strapped the JATO bottles beneath the Black Widow and prepared for something. No one had ever tried on this aircraft before. Pilots advanced the throttles, engines screamed, and when the rockets ignited, the world behind the plane vanished in fire. For a moment, the P-61 didn't just accelerate, it lunged forward, the rockets kicked like a hammer, pushing the aircraft past the limits of its normal takeoff roll. The nose lifted sooner, the controls tightened faster, and the heavy night fighter leapt into the sky with a force. Pilots had never experienced. Some crews said the blast felt like being punched between the shoulder blades. Others said it felt like the plane had suddenly grown a third engine. The tests worked, with Jado, the Black Widow could take off from short island runways, overloaded with fuel, ammunition, and radar gear, the very things that made it so deadly at night. And although Jado never became standard on every P-61, the tests proved one thing, this aircraft wasn't just adaptable, it was unstoppable when pushed to its limits. The Black Widow entered history as America's first, purpose-built night fighter. But in these Jado tests, for a brief moment, it became something far more brutal, a night hunter launched by fire.